Hello everyone. Uh, here in this video, I will try to explain how can you represent a set. A set is generally represented in two different ways. One is known as roster form, always is known as tabular. Roster, amplified composition. Roster maintained for our report more than history from We have to mention the elements of that collection. So the collection of the element can be mentioned for the proper as I, depending upon the given condition or criteria. Or you can tabulate the elements. Next one is set builder or definition. So we will try to write down all the information in the set form. Okay, so let me explain what it is actually. Let us consider one example. The set of all the letters in the word better is a well defined collection. Do you know? First of all, a collection is considered no doubt. But here in this one collection, all the letters will be there. All the letters. But remember, the letters should belong from the word better. Better number for two. Zimanta letter as he letter the letter So obviously a set in a specific name. Here it is written in sentence form. So we'll write down roster or tabular form. Roster tabular form means the information will be given depending upon the information you have to mention the elements. The number of elements may be finite or maybe infinite. Here in this one word the number of letters is finite. That's why the, the set that we get. After having the information, obviously it will be a finite set. So it has to have a specific name that I have given a. Any letter you can use to represent it. Okay, so A is set. So we will try to write down the letters. Okay, from the B. Generally, already I have informed that you have to use small letters. But from the word you have to write down, that's why whatever may be the uh, I expect, uh, what are the letters that they letter, so are in the word? Just like as you have to mention P, E, E. Listen. You have to mention the letters. So, T repeats two times. So, that's why you are not supposed to write it for two times. Dubai, you can write it. Repetition is not allowed in the set. So, what a distinct element will be like. A distinct element should be here. Element should be distinct. Every element cannot be repeated in case of the representation of a set. So B E T. So B E T will not write down D here. We will not write down E because E always repeated for two times. Then come to the next one. This is the representation of the uh, roster form or tabular form of a set where the informations are given. This is the first one. Repetition is not allowed to get a letter D P for a line. And all sets are distinct, or that's what capital letters are given, only to capital letters. Generally, to represent the elements, we will use small letters. Capital letters, capital letters, capital letters. But repetition is not allowed, the most important thing. Repetition not allowed. The elements should be distinct. Okay. This is the representation of most starting letters. It's very simple, that's not mentioned the elements. Maybe finite or maybe infinite. Okay. So let us consider one another example. This is the uh, from where we try to write down in set builder or definition form. For example, a set is given 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, just like this. So, in, whenever you want a question, you can even write the set in set builder or definition method. Already, it will be there in roster or table method. How you roster or table method? You can write sentence or like that. Now you have to write down the given information in set builder definition method. So obviously name will be the same. So just listen carefully for the rest of this. First of all, how many elements are there? Maybe five or maybe five. There are five number of elements are there. Five. So in set builder definition method, you are not supposed to mention all the elements as this. Good element ki kito mention kori wana lagi. Will not try to mention the to represent all the elements, we will consider an arbitrary quantity. I mean, very good. 
variable whose value varies. So just take this one. X is the variable. X means what? X is an element of the same. X may be 3, this is a variable because it doesn't have any specific value. This one may be 3, maybe 6, maybe 9, maybe 12, maybe 15. To represent all the elements, I have to use the variable whose value varies. But I am going to write down the set in such a way that all the information will be there. And I got to go after considering the variable, try to find out the similarities among the elements. A element will have the similarities to identify for us. What they are under what condition they have known as a collection, well defined collection. Key condition or any key condition of what depend for it, that are well defined collection. Now try to identify that condition. Kundu condition of what important is that are going to be found. Kill our number is that are going to be found. Kill our number. Then here key condition which I am going to find. Try to identify that condition. So I have got. So if you observe carefully, this is nothing but 3 into 1, am I correct? It will be 3 into 2, 3 into 3, 3 into 4, 3 into 5. Obviously, one pattern will be here. Identify group of parties, but I am going to have a problem. But pattern is there to be seen. Set up for a pattern. But if you have a pattern, you will have a pattern. If you have a pattern, you will have a pattern. Okay. So here we have so many different conditions. Maybe here, I have got this one. Why do I say this is so much remarkable for this one? Three level one month in level first two point two month in level second to third three month in level third four month in level twelve five month in level fifteen. Then is what they are making that elements are getting etc. Getting that all are month in block three. That is X a element pillar. I will get one point three month in. Then one point three month in will get one month in one month in two month in three month in four month in five month in. So a place to very far many more very good this one. They can only to represent trees constant, trees everywhere. But the next term is variable. To represent it, you have to mention it as variable. But limitations should be there. And also, what you consider for example, n key one, n is first of all the nature numbers. Okay, n is the nature number. Okay, you will see the nature number in this one. Correct. The nature number is the nature number set to n dot represent for us. Point actually, n is directly key key one. If you actually put a bolder link on it, but we cannot write down in the bold form, so that's why I have to define this one. This is nothing but bold letter n. n to me, a n to me belongs to be called a query, so n to nature number that I will call it. But how many nature numbers are there? Sabi, what do you want to say? It's a fine number of nature numbers are there. All are using you here or what? No. So nature number holding up a little bit is what we call it. And n or hello to me, I think it's going to be as well. So, 5 power 5 of the whole 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 line you know, it will be 1 power 1 of the number. Other this one, it will not be. How can you write this one? First of all, you have to consider it very good job, you have to consider it very good job, you have to consider it very good job, you have to consider it very good job. Just try to do the limitations, it's not really good. Zimaan para zimaan di kya. It about equal to x equal to thai sen. You have to stop 3 multiple to what? 3 multiple to 3, 1, 3, 2, 3, 3, 3, 4, 3, 5, 6, 7, or minus 3, you have something to do. Something to do with the end, you have to 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 end, अरे ये नेस्टर नंबर को जगह किसी को हाउ पड़ेगा सब तो नेस्टर नंबर में यूज़ करना है किमारों के नंबर में वन और बड़ा फाइव पड़ेगा तो पता होता है लेकिन उन्हें एन तो नेस्टर नंबर सो बोला ही हो नेक्स्ट एन और तो फाइव पड़ेगा तो बोलो वन और फाइव पड़ेगा तो बोलो वन वो पड़ेगा नहीं Okay, so this is a representation of set in definition or set in a form. Okay, so I hope uh, you have got my point. How can we represent the set in definition or set in a form? So let me start the other one. Here also, the other one is the state condition is there. As I have been in the natural number, what is the smallest natural number? One is the smallest natural number. That's why you are not supposed to mention it also. It will mention how to hold what it is. कारण नेस्टर नंबर को लेकर फाइव और किसी टाइम नंबर को फोर भी लिखो सकते हैं कि तो जीरो नहीं रहेगा कि मालूम कैसे बोलते हैं कि मालूम कैसे बोलते हैं दैट इस लोअर लिमिट इस ऑलरेडी डिफाइन सो यू मे राइट डाउन और नॉट बी ये तो लिखी लोगों को लिखी लोगों को बट दिस कंडीशन आप आर्डिंग so all are multiple of 5, not only multiple. So that means if you should think about it, that means it is 5, 5 squared is nothing but 5 cube. 
So to represent it, we will consider a symbol x, what is x, x is it is the power to the same, base to the same answer. So x is equal to 5 to the power n, we will do very good, so that we can read the power to the So what is the limitation? First of all, n or 2 will be next turn number 2, next turn number 1, and n cap k or n or 2 will be done, 3 by 3 to the same. 3 to the same. So in the same way, first of all, we consider variable to represent it. So the variable is x, suppose. What is x? Already we have come to know x in the form of fraction. What is the similar sum of them? If you observe carefully, the denominator is increased by 1 by the numerator. Numerator is the denominator to x. 1, 2, 3, 3, 4, 4, 5, 5, 6. They didn't drag on one. So that means I have written here as x is equal to n by both are same thing as, as they are same thing so that's why you have to use variables in place of numerator as well as the denominator but the denominator is totally related with numerator that's why I am going to ex use the same symbol n and plus 1 what is n? what is the smallest value of n? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 all are natural numbers that's why n belongs to natural numbers and what is the number limit? What is the lower limit? 1. May or may not. If the smallest number. N is, what is the smallest value of n? 1. If it is 1, 1 plus 1, 2. If it is 2, 2 plus 1, 3. If it is 3, then it will be 4. If it is 4, then it will be 5. If it is 5, then it will be 6. In this way, you have to write down all the elements. Restriction should be here. So if I not write down like it, then what will happen to you know? We will consider 4.5. Because what is n it is not mentioned here? And to key number of the number real number of the So they can and it's not specific, you can consider any real number because it lies between 1 and 5. So I think you have got my point, I hope. So in the next video, I will try to explain different types of sets which will be used further. Uh, so just go through different questions which are here in the textbook or reference book. So thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you have got my point.